gonna do black and white stripes mm -hmm. okay body's done wow. <laughs> i do need to add some lashes and some more finishing touches so who's ready mm -hmm. to see the end result let's see All done. <laughs> whoa Alright, hey there beauties, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be diving into the world of makeup looks and reviewing them with the stunning looks of the one and only content creator, Arthur Mayhew. So, let's get into the video. Eyebrows. Oh, okay, three slits. I'm just using a nude eyeliner pencil to create the slits first. And then I'm just filling in the rest of my brows like normal. I need to quickly do my base. Okay, base is done. Cute. Eyeshadow. Actually, it's all right. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a white eyeshadow base first, just to make sure the eyeshadow colors barely pop. Yellow first on the inner corner. Oh, that's bright. Blue <laughs> along the lower lash line, and then this very bright Barbie pink eyeliner. What is that? A little heart. Oh, okay, so cute. we got a white squiggle, and then some little yellow and purple hearts or something. I can do that. Oh. Bring it in, out, bring it in. Now let's go in with some yellow face paint to create the little hearts. One here. She's one good. Right here. I don't think one I was able to right do it. Right <laughs> Just like that. And Cute. now the two little purple hearts. Freckles. Oh, that's a good choice. It is cute. So I'm just doing the strawberry. Uh, strawberry. Watermelon. <laughs> so I'm just doing the watermelon outline first in white face paint. Then going in with that red face paint. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, I almost forgot to do the blush on the nose. Cute. Lipstick. Mm, okay. Okay, mm -hmm. blend it out. <laughs> Look like I've got two bananas on my lips. <laughs> okay, now I'm going in with some burgundy eyeshadow to do that zero shape or O shape, whatever it's meant to be. Okay, I do need to add some more finishing touches, so who's ready to see the end result? Let's see. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> Here it is. I don't think it all goes together, but I do really love the watermelons. I feel that's like that's cute. the best part. Comment a watermelon emoji if you agree. But be honest, guys, what do you think? Is this a cute or a fail? Cute. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. What are you waiting for? Thanks for watching. Funny faces filter. Let's do it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, wow. foundation first. Squeeze. Blend it out. <laughs> I don't think I could do it. Best I can. Concealer. Uh, oh, <laughs> oh, no. Crazy. Nose. <laughs> Add some blush. <laughs> Looks like it's blended out. I think I would have poked myself in the eye. Wrong. Eyebrows. Go. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> I can't get the timing right. Oh. No, that doesn't look good. Okay, eyeshadow, brown all over the lid. Tap, tap, tap it. Oh, I have a feeling this might look nice. Try and do a quick wing it out. I feel like it needs some bling bling, so I'm gonna add some of this. Oh, can you see the shine? <laughs> Time for liner. So this liner's actually got like a wing stamp. I'm gonna be a bit cheeky and use this stamp. Oh, Oops, I sorry. Did a good job, but <laughs> out and in. This is stressing me out. Highlighter. No. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Ooh. Ooh. Lipstick. Make my I'm eyes hurt. Like a nude or a brown. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> nude first. All right, in the center. Then I'm going to go on top with this brown plumping gloss. Oh, it smells so yummy. Nice. Okay, guys, I need to fix my hair, add finishing touches. So who's ready to see that end result? <laughs> now let's take this filter off. Ah! That's <laughs> cute. <laughs> the eyebrows are a different story but what do you think is this cute? A cute or a fail it's cute hit the like button before you go and subscribe to my cute. channel if you haven't already bye crazy contour let's do it oh let's i don't know see. how to approach this i'm gonna do one right here in the middle like that and then here 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 right here along the sides and join it up just drag it out mm, that's okay mm. I think like that. Kind of looks like a bird flying. <laughs> Up here, down. I think I did it. <laughs> Time for the concealer. So I'm going in with the brush again so I can get those super neat lines or at least try. Mm -hmm. oh, I did it. <laughs> a line coming up on that side and on this side like a branch. So and the eyes are just going straight across. Here, here. Join it up. 
I think that might have been way too much. And now for the blush. I'm gonna do a line and just fill all of that in. I'm trying to do this so neat. Can you guys even see the orange? Okay, here's how it's looking. Before I blend it out, hit the like button and comment and let me know what you think. Start blending out that contour. Okay, let's blend. Blend out that M. Now let's do the concealer. Oh wow, that blended out way better than I thought. Now let's blend this side. Oh, the under eyes are looking good. I kind of like how this nose contour looks. I do need to add some lip liner or gloss or something. So who's ready to see the end result? Let's see. Yeah. Here's the final look. I think that looks good. Impressed. That looks I think good. It blended out really nice, and I like the dimension it's given to my face. I guess. <laughs> but and be honest, what do you pretty. guys think? Is it a hit or a miss? If you think it's it a looks hit good, for me. Out emoji below. Thanks for watching. Clown makeup, let's do it. So uh -oh. I decided I want to do a black and white clown, so I'm going to go in with this Meron cream stick in white and just apply it all over. And this one's really creamy, so it blends easily. Okay, I'm all covered and blended out. So I'm just going to start filling in the brows first. I'm just using black Meron face paint. Okay, moving on to the eyeshadow, I'm going to put some black in my crease. Blend it all out, but leaving that middle part white. I do some liner first, and then I'm going to bring the inner corner down. And I know it looks a bit messy but it's fine because I'm going to blend the line out. And that's the eyeshadow done. Now I'm going to create my clown lines using black face paint. Ooh. Um, yeah. Then I'm wow. going to join it up right here. I've doubled up these lines, but I don't know if it looks good. Okay, now for the nose. So I'm filling in all of this area here with black. Why does it kind of look like a little mm. animal nose? <laughs> or like I'm a character in the Goofy movie. Then good. I'm just going to draw the lips in with black. Okay, now I'm going to add some bottom lashes. And I'm going to make them smaller as I get towards the front. I'm adding a bit of white to the center of the lip. Time for something a little yeah, detailed. Really so I'm going to do some black dots. One here, about there. Here and here. I think I'm done with the details for the face. So let's move on to the neck and the chest. I'm just going to do black and white stripes. Mm -hmm. Okay, body's done. Wow. <laughs> I do need to add some lashes and some more finishing touches. So who's ready mm -hmm. to see the end result? Let's see. All done. <laughs> Whoa. Of course, I had to add some big extra lashes. <laughs> Look how long they are. Scary, I really like but kind of cute. Like the dot details Scary, so kind of cool. cute. And I've been waiting to use this wig, but what do you guys think? Is this creepy or cool? Do me a big favor mm, and hit the subscribe button. It's kind of in between. Pink versus peach. Let's try them on my skin tone. Starting off with pink. So I've got the shade pink pomelio. Pomelio. Comment and let me know how to pronounce that. Dot hair, dot hair, dot hair. It does look light, but I'm going to trust the process. <gasps> wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm actually really happy. I usually really struggle to like conceal my under eye bags, but this has done like a really good job. Oh, natural. Oh, I could cry. So I'm going to go in with Easy Bake in the shade Cherry Blossom. Can you guys see how pink that is? And there's these cute cute little powder puffs. I'm gonna go in with the heart one and pick up some of the product and tap in and then look up and go in with my powder puff. Oh my goodness. I've always wanted to be a part of the Flawless Under Eyes Girlies Club. <laughs> Maybe now I can finally join. Now I'm gonna go with the Easy Bake and Snatch to brighten yeah, and this good. one is in the shade Cherry Blossom too. Okay, let's use one of the tinier powder puffs. I'm gonna dip into the Easy Bake and then press it in. Oh, guys, look at this. And I don't even have any makeup on. I am very, very impressed. Me too. Now let's do Team Peach. If I look the pink that much, I definitely know I'm going to look the peach. So this is in the shade Peach, of course. Her, her, and her. Mm. Me like, me like. Going in with Easy Bake in the shade Peach Pie. Dip in and set. <gasps> it looks so smooth. Smooth criminal. Easy Bake and Snatch in the shade Peach Pie. I'm just going to tap into it. Let and see how this looks more. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> and we're done. I can't decide I think the pink look better. I love both. <laughs> the pink. I'm in love. Okay, let me go finish the rest of my face and I'll be right back. Okay, here's the end result. I still love how both look with full face of makeup. Which one do you guys think suits me better? Are you team pink or team peach? Team pink. Comment and let me know. Do me a big favor and hit the like button. Thanks for watching. Full face of Huda Beauty makeup. Let's do it. Going in with some color corrector and I'm using the shade Mango. First time using this product, so I hope it does a good job. Do you guys see that? Foundation. I've got the shade Toffee, so hopefully this is my shade. Oh, this is very full coverage. And blend. Concealer time. 
I'm going in with the shade Preline in the corner, outer corner. No how to beauty contour, so we're just going to use this mysterious product. Cheekbones, right here, and my five head. I'm going to start blending the contour first, and just pinching the sponge and using the tip of it. I hide those backs. Oh, I love it. I want to brighten my under eyes even more, so I've also got this shade Nugget, Nougat. Dop, dop. My oh my, what a bright under eye. <laughs> that blended in beautifully. Easy bake. Go. Ooh. Let's see. Oh, Miss Hudder, you knew what you was doing with these products. Okay, now let's snatch. Mm. Time for eyes. Going in with this new shade right here. It's a pretty Ooh. eyeshadow They're palette. Really also nice and creamy. Then in with this brown in the crease. Okay, I'm impressed. Going in with this cream black shade. I'm gonna try and get a thin line. Oh, nobody moved. Nobody moved. Did I do it? I think I did it. My hands are shaking so much. <laughs> Okay, I had to hold my breath for that bit. She Girl really did a good job. Like waterline. Ooh, filling in the wing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mascara, one coat. Wow. Okay, let's see. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> it's not clumpy or anything. Yeah, I like that brush, mascara. So we're going to improvise this shade mixed with this shade. Right here. Oh, that's kind of cute. Going in with this lipstick in the shade interview. Then finish off with the goth gloss. Glide it over. Now I need to add some finishing touches. So who's ready to see the end result? Let's okay, see. here's the final look. Oh, <laughs> Be honest. I like it. Testing. It's pretty. What would you rate this look from 1 to 10? Comment and let me Definitely know what brand I should do next. Thanks for watching. Wrapping things up. So let's summarize in today's video. Was it a hit or miss? What did you guys think? I feel like the makeup looks have definitely left an impact on me. I especially love the clown one. It was kind of creepy and cool at the same time. And I also love the um, Cutie Beauty uh, makeup looks that she did. I love that as well. But all of her makeups in today's video was really wonderful. So they was definitely a hit. But I need you guys to comment down below to tell me what you guys think. And... If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you to hit that subscribe button for more reaction videos coming your way. Until next time, stay fabulous and let's get this video up to 100 views. And please subscribe to my channel. The goal is to get up to 12,000 subscribers and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.